Today we're going to talk about straight jumps. Straight jumps are the foundation on trampoline. So we're going to teach you some different ways of doing straight jumps properly. Okay, so the first thing we'll show you is that when you do straight jumps, your legs are together in the air but apart on the trampoline. Not um, apart, well not together and together on the trampoline because then you don't have as much balance. So we're going to show you why. So first we're going to show you legs together. You don't have as much balance. And then legs apart. Now let's try that in bouncing. So you can do a couple straight jumps. Now if his legs are apart. When you are doing straight jumps or any or any skill, you should be looking at the end of the trampoline, which is you see the X over there. There's this line which follows through the X. So you look here at the end of the line. If you look at the end of the line, it will help you keep your balance. If you don't, you'll probably be jumping off the trampoline. <laughs> so, Jack, could you show us one with you looking at the end? looking at the end if you want to keep your balance and be safe. Once again. So, we're going to talk about flat feet pointed toes. When you're on the trampoline, you want to um, flex your feet. When you're in the air, point your toes. And it's not like if you were on a, a, a hard surface. On a hard surface, you would want to absorb the landing. On the trampoline, you want to stretch the springs. So, we're going to show you flex feet, point, and toes. And, when you want to do your stretch jumps, you want your Bend your knees and hit the trampoline so you can get more height in your straight jumps to do a higher and better skill. So you want to bend your knees before you hit the trampoline. You don't want to bend your knees when you're at the top of your bounce. You want to bend your knees when you're starting to sort of get down. And when you hit the trampoline, then you will go higher. So, this is an, ex is an example of what you should try to do. So that's what you should try to do. When you jump on trampoline, you don't keep your arms by your ears by your legs you arm circle you backwards so you put your arms by your ears then around by your ears and around each jump one arm circle per jump so jack here is going to show you what it should look like Okay, we're going to talk about straight jumps again. So, when you're doing the straight jumps now, you're going to try staying straight up. If you lean backwards, you'll go backwards. If you lean forward, you'll go forwards. If you lean sideways, you'll go sideways, which you don't want to do. So, if you stay up straight, then you'll bounce straight up. So, this is an example of what it should look like. This is what you do not want to do. 
In this way. In this way. Lean forward. So you don't want to do that kind of stuff. You want to stay straight up so you stay in the middle of the X. A way to see if you're improving on trampoline or not is to time your jumps. The higher you go on your jumps, the longer it will take. So you get three jumps to get started and then the rest of the 10 jumps we're going to time. So we're gonna show you. Okay, Jack, are you ready for the height drill? Yeah. All right, hang on, wait. All right, I'm ready to time you. You can go. One, two, starting now. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and stop. All right, Jack, your time was 14.76 seconds. Good job, Jack. Even better.